We have to be grateful because if we're ungrateful and always complaining, Allah is going to give you more to complain about. I was in one of the Gulf states and somebody was complaining about the price of gasoline, the taxi driver, 25 cents at the time. <laughs> now it's a lot higher. Why? Because they keep complaining. Go ahead, complain all you want. Because if you love to complain, Allah will give you plenty to complain about. But if you want to show gratitude, Allah will give you plenty to show gratitude about. They did a study at Davis. It's called the Gratitude Study for Depressed People. They had them write down every day, every morning, 10 things they were grateful for. Over a period of a month, people's depression started being lifted. If you start counting the blessings of Allah, you'll never come to an end. And you can count blessings like just eyelashes. The people don't have eyelashes. They fall out. The eyelashes are a wonderful blessing. Or some people have dry eyes. So if you have moisture in your eyes, what a blessing. If you have teeth, what a blessing. If you don't have teeth, if you have dentures, what a blessing. There's people that don't have dentures. If you lose one arm, what a blessing. You didn't lose both arms. If you lose both arms, what a blessing. Now they have prosthetic devices that enable you to do things. Ibn Abbas said, in every tribulation in dunya, there are three blessings hidden that you have to recognize. The first is that it could have been worse. The second is that it's in your dunya and not in your deen. And the third, in your worldly affairs and not in your religious affairs. And the third, it's in this world and not in the next. And you should be grateful for that. People now are complaining. Allah said, لِيَبْلُوَكُمْ أَيُّكُمْ أَحْسَنُ amala." He's going to try you to see who of you are the best in actions. وَلَا نُبْلُوَنَّكُمْ We're going to try you. لَتُبْلَوُنَّ فِي أَمْوَالِكُمْ وَأَنفُسِكُمْ You will be tried in your, in your wealth and in your lives. وَلَا تَسْمَعُونَ مِنَ الَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابِ مِنْ قَبْرِكُمْ وَالَّذِينَ أَشَرَكُوا أَذَنْ كَثِيرًا Allah told us, you're going to hear all these people telling how horrible you are and how terrible your religion is. Allah said that. What does He say? How's our response? What's our response? وَإِنْ تَصْبِرُوا And if you show patience, وَتَتَّقُوا And show piety, restraint, control yourselves. فَإِنَّ ذَلِكَ مِنْ عَزْمِ الْأُمُورِ Because that is at the essence of this matter. That is at the essence of this matter. This is our deen. 